Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Hey, what's up, my peoples? I'm Go here, the freaking geek himself, and today we will be reviewing the Kamen Rider Saber DX Sword of Logos Buckle and the Kobuta Sankyodai Wonder Ride book. So here we are. And there they are. And first and foremost, as always, we'll take a quick look at the packaging right up front. We have the buckle, we have the book, we have Saber, Kenzon, Buster up top. Kenzon, Buster, Saber, things and stuff. On the bottom, stuff and things. On this side we have writers. On the other side of the box we have Saber. On the back of the box we have our obligatory product shots. It does this at the other things and stuff. Warning, don't eat anything in this box that could be very bad for you. And we have Sad Pac-Man! And that's basically it for the packaging. And moving right along here, we have the Sword of Logos buckle and the Kobuta Sankyodai Wonder Ride book. Now, before we take a look at the belt itself, let's take a look at the included Wonder Ride book. So here we have Kobuta Sankyodai, a.k.a. the Three Little Pigs. So, you can see right there, Kobuta Sankyodai. And you have the piggies. One, two, three. They're, pretty little, they're so happy. They're happy little piggies. And the arrow telling you it goes to the third slot in the driver because it is a storybook. And your typical Wonder Ride bookie goodness when it comes to the detailing, speaker, battery compartment, scanning bits, all of that good stuff. It says book on the side because clever. But that is basically it. So let's get down to the noises, shall we? Let's, so as always, push the button on the bottom and you get... Tells you what it is, in case you already forgot. And when we open the front cover all the way. We have that. And then we have the piggies, the house, and of course all the sideways text. And your QR code. You want to scan it? Go ahead. Free scan on me. You are welcome. And of course, all that text there, which you can decipher on your own time. But there you have that. Now, without further ado, let's bring in the Seiken Sword Driver and our friend the Rider Can, because if the Rider Can, you can. So let's get down to it. So there you have that. Now we'll do our attacks. Explosions! Sometimes the book closes when you do that. That's, that's weird. That's weird. And now we'll do our scan. And now the sword of evilness. So 
So you have that. And moving on to the main event of the evening, here we have the Sword of Logos buckle. And this is basically the belt that any rider who doesn't use a driver wears around their waist. Um, so yeah, this is what you'll see on Buster, on Kenzan, on Slash. This is what they wear since they don't actually use the uh, Seiken Sword Driver. So yeah, this is just kind of like the generic belt, basically. So let's get in close here so we can take a look at the details. You can see the buckle just done all in black. You do have some nice molded details in there. You have this bit of gold. It says Rider in that sideways text. And the strap just done in gray. Got the little slack holder there on the back. And you do have the Hisats holder. And it's the exact same Hisats holder that we've reviewed already. Just in gray instead of black, with gold instead of silver, but it's the exact same mold, so no differences there. Yeah, we'll just turn this around to the other side. You can see again, the exact same mold. The only difference is just in the coloration. And of course you have spots to store up to three Wonder Ride books. Just pop them in there and you have storage for another one there and a storage for one right here. And of course you have a sheath for your sword. So we can plug Kenzon's sword there. We can plug Slash's sword onto it as well if we want to. And of course, it still has the exact same functionality with the sword driver to do an attack. That explosions! But yes, um, has all the same functionality. So yeah, that is uh, pretty much it. So there you have the sort of Logos buckle and Kobuta Sankyodai Wonder Ride book. And um, yeah, honestly, this isn't a necessity um, unless you're going completist on this line and you're going completist on DX Wonder Ride books, then you're probably gonna wanna pick this up. But if you don't care about the DX books and you're happy just having the, uh, you know, Gashapon or Candy Toy versions, then you don't really need to get this. I mean, it's just kind of the generic belt. It has the same Hisats holder that, you know, that's already been released, so. Not a necessity, totally up to you if you feel you need this for your collection, you know, depending on what you want for your collection, so. There you go. Now I picked this up from Hobby Link Japan, but of course there are many other sites you can go to for stuff like this if you are interested, such as CS Toys, Ami Ami, Hobby Search, Mandarake, of course there's always eBay and Amazon. You can also check out BigBadToyStore.com for some common Rider items. I'll put a link to their site in the description down below so you can check that out. You can also check out my Kamen Rider Saber playlist for any reviews you may have missed. Also linked in the description down below so you can check that out as well. And I think that's it. So don't forget to check out M Games, check out Love Peace Paranormal, follow me on Twitter, all of that good stuff down in the description below. And I think that's pretty much all there is to say. So there is the Kamen Rider Saber DX Sword of Logos Buckle and Kobuta Sankyonai Wonder Ride book. And this is them go saying, remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Big Geek, be proud. Home in your face.